Okay, so we've got a TVZ here. And playing against a gold level Zerg player. Kind of newish to the game, I suppose. Um, gold, some silver. Plays a bit of everything, but kind of lowish level, but gold now in Heart of the Swarm. And so I'm going for this new strategy of um, putting Widow Mines in his bases instead of dropping, and then um, then uh, doing some harassment with some Widow Mine drops and then uh, pushing out while getting my third base. So, getting my gas. He's got overlords hanging out. blocked his expansion there and then he puts it there so I just kinda put my SCV here just to see what's up and I made a mistake here I let him in my base that was stupid but whatever no big deal and all this harassment I got to a lot of minerals really quick so things got delayed so I kind of called an audible and while I had my factory at 400 I just took my second command center because I knew this wasn't going to be done in time to build a starport where I'd be out of minerals. I've got tons of minerals. So I just built a command center, got that going. Here are his lings. Kills that. So I send my SCV home and get a bunker up. So while the bunker's going up, Put my marines in, get some more marines going, starport does a medevac, command center, get another gas, get another widow mine, get a tech lab. I decide I'm going to start putting out the widow mines without the medevac. So I just start putting out the widow mines, building more widow mines. And it looks like he's got his lings here, so he sees it. I try to burrow, but not in time. So his widow mines. He's got a lot of zerglings coming, and he's morphing banelings. And I kind of have a feeling this is coming. So while sending out my medevac to drop here to see if he's taking that basin to drop a widow mine there. I also SCB ready. So he sees he saw the drop, but instead of dropping in his main, I drop it here and prevent his next command center. So he's got one there, one there. He's next up. Uh, and by this point, he's got all of his lings here. He's got his veins here. I just want to look over and see what he's doing. So I kind of boost beyond. I boost around. Get my tanks building. See that he's got bane lings and a hatchery so no lair so I don't have to worry about mutas yet so I kinda boost around keep it alive we don't mine we don't mine and now put my siege tank on the high ground got my bunker got my guys building he's gonna start to push out now and in the meantime, 
I've got another factory, double widow mine, an armory. So I'm going to start building Hellbats out of that since he's still going Baneling. And he's going to push in here and take some massive damage. So this is, he knows this is not going to work. Good positioning on the siege tank, marines, bunker. That's not going to work. Goes home. Take these two Widow Mines. I start using this guy. He killed an Observer, um, which is good. And I kind of keep having him attack through here to basically clear a path for my Widow Mines, which are going to come in this medevac. Since I see that, I assume there might be some more stuff coming, but he's going to tech up. So there it is. This is tech. Bunker, Supply Depot, Supply Depot. Stim. More supply depots, keep building SCVs. So now the Viking goes first, and then the Widow Mine drop. In the income tab, right now it's 20 to 40, so I'm way ahead in the income tab. And I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let my Viking go in first, start tanking damage. I'm gonna drop the Widow Mines and instantly burrow them. I'm gonna pause it right here in the unit tab. 20. 57 and 6. 20, 60, and 6. So he lost 4. I don't know how many is that? 45. 4, 45. And, or, yeah, he lost. Five drones, 45 lings, and then maybe one bane ling. So those are pretty successful. And the medevac gets away. All this time, I'm building two medevacs. I mean, excuse me, I'm building two hellbats, a tank, three marines, stims on the way, more, more, uh, more SCVs, and I'm way ahead here in the SCV count. So he gets an observer, kills those widow mines, but the damage has been dealt. Send him home. Move another tank down. Build more tanks. Get plus one, plus one on my marines. Get plus one armor on my hellbats. Build more marines. Build more tanks, build a bunch more Hellbats, build more barracks, get some turrets out just in case. There's going to be some Mew to play, which there should be soon, but there isn't. He's just going for Ling Bane, but I have to prepare for the Mew because it's really the only way I can die right now. Three turrets, couple turrets, three turrets. And here's my force. I'm at 130 to 60. I don't know that I'm this far ahead. He takes his third over here. Never tried to take this third. And I push out. Metamorphosis complete. So he sees me pushing. I don't see these guys, but I basically know they're about to come, so I'm just ready to stim the minute I see anything. There it is. Stim. Stim my guys. Cover them up. I lose one tank, maybe. And I got Marine, Hellbat, and he says, fuck it. Shit. I don't know what. Booyah. Unit lost 700 to 3200. It was just like not even close. Um, he never tried to take that expand, and he did take this expand. So I really think that one thing I want to do I did put a widow mine here. I did put a widow mine here. I guess I want to put another widow mine there. Um, but I really needed that tank production. So what I can do is just uh, when this comes up, I can do another widow mine. Um, thirds on the way. Again, I'm at 55 workers at the 15 minute mark. That's pretty good considering I've got a big force. Um, protection, units on the way. 
Yeah. Feeling pretty good about that. 